In this video, I'm going to fix another Google or Gmail login error problem. When you try to open your Gmail, you will get this kind of pop-up error message. To log back into your account, they ask you to take some additional action. That means they ask you to verify yourself. Basically, this happens when someone changes your password or they will remove your account from this device. So, now they ask you to verify yourself. To fix this error, there are many three ways. First, you can enter your login details and log back into your account. The second method, you can recover your account if you can't log in back to your account. As the final option, you can remove this account from this device. When you got this kind of message, as well as you will get this kind of notification too. So, let's jump into our video and fix this error. So since we got that error for Gmail application, I will use Gmail one. So open Gmail application. If you got this pop-up window, just tap take action. Then you will get this check-in info window and you will get this verify it's you window. So if you want to do it directly, you can swipe down to the notification bar. Then you can just tap this notification. Then you will be redirected to the same window. Here. Like I said you, they ask you to confirm or verify yourself. To go forward, tap next. Now they ask you to enter your password. Here they ask you to enter the recent password. Like this, you can enter your password and try the next button. Then sometimes they will allow you to log back into your account if you enter the latest password. But if someone has changed it or if you don't remember your password, you will get this kind of another error message so if you don't have your password instead of logging back into your account you have to recover it to recover it just tap try another way option then it will show all possible recovery methods one after another here if you have access to any of these recovery methods i highly recommend you to select at least one verification method but if you don't have that one just tap get help or Try another way option. Here you can see it will show all possible recovery method or verification method one after another. Like this one, if you used to log into your Google or Gmail ID using another device, they ask to verify from there. They will send a pop-up message. You can tap yes, then you can able to recover your account or log into your account. But unfortunately, if you don't recognize this device, you can tap try another way. Here, if you turn on two-factor authentication, you can use that application as well as if you generated some backup codes, you can use those backup codes too. Then this one is important. If you already added some recovery phone number or another recovery email address, you can select that and you can ask them to get a code to that email or phone number. So using that code, you can verify yourself and you can log back into an account easily. But unfortunately, if you don't have access to any of these verification methods, including your recovery phone number and email address, just tap the last option, try another way in the bottom left corner. Now they ask you to enter your fingerprint, paste or screen lock. Here, I highly recommend you to enter any of these. If you don't have access, just tap try another way. Finally, they will get this welcome back window and they will allow you to create a new strong password without having any all password. After that, you can use this password to log back into your hacker account. But unfortunately, if you couldn't recover your account using this method, I highly recommend you to watch the full tutorial. In that video, I have shown you two different methods to recover your account. Then I will move to the final method. For the final option, if you don't need this Google ID on your device, you can remove it. To remove your account, you can use any Google application. But if you do want to quickly, you can use settings. After go to settings, scroll down until you find passwords and account. Here, if you tap that, you can see all your Google accounts on this device here select the error gmail id so you can tap that one then you can tap the remove button then 
you will get another pop-up window in the pop-up window tap the remove account to after all this error account will be removed from your account that error message won't come again but instead of removing your account still you want to access this google id within your device and you want to recover it so i invite you to watch the full tutorial you can find that video in the description or click this end screen video and come on over that's it for today's tutorial see you in the next one later